What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be reviewing and breaking down The Flash Season 9 Episode 6. So guys, the episode starts with a look at Becky Sharp, aka Hazard. I don't really know if they call her on that on the show, but that's you know that's the character. Um, so this is yeah, the, this is the first time we've seen her since season four. Um, and for some reason, she had this whole like intro thing saying that now she's unlucky instead of like when she used to be lucky. And it was just super cringe. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, not exactly the best start to the episode. But she does also say that the reason she's alive is because of Crisis, as, as obviously she did die in season four um so that does make sense and how does becky know about crisis i i have no idea that's that's kind of ridiculous and yeah with barry and iris you know going on vacation to celebrate iris's pregnancy they of course weren't really in this episode which is when i realized that this episode was really gonna suck so yeah, with that said, I'm just going to vaguely say what else happened in the episode. So just a couple other storylines. Cecile was defending Becky Sharp for, for a crime that Becky didn't commit, which worked out, obviously. Um, Mark was working with Keon, discovering her new powers, and apparently toward the end, she didn't have any powers. She's just like, we don't know what she is. She's not human, but she's also not metahuman, so that didn't really make much sense. Um, so yeah, with all that said, this is pretty close to being the worst episode in Flash history. This episode was atrocious. I it's like it's all it's like almost funny how bad this episode was. Um like over half the episode was just like Cecile Allegra and Chester just like having like emotional conversations like what what is this? And I'm not even kidding. Every second of this episode was cringe. Every single second of it. It oh, I don't this it was just terrible. But anyways, at the end, we kind of get back to a little bit of normalcy, I guess, with Barry and Iris actually, like, being in the episode um, for, you know, their baby shower or whatever. Um, but yeah, like I said, this episode was just awful. I, I, oh, they should have literally just not had this episode in the season and just have had, like, one less episode total. I would have been all right with that if I knew that this would be the episode that they would come out with. Um, so yeah, if you're, if you're watching this review and you haven't seen the episode yet, don't watch it. It is not worth your time. So basically I would just say that, you know, the only good regulars on the show now is Barry, Iris, and kind of Joe, I guess. Um, but yeah, this season is off to an absolutely awful start. Um, so hopefully they can do better. Episode seven does look a little bit interesting. So I, obviously it's going to be way better than this episode. Oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, hopefully the second half of season nine with, you know, Oliver returning, Wally returning, tons of other returning characters. Um, hopefully it's actually good because Eric Wallace put together probably the worst episode I've ever seen in Flash history today. So yeah, guys, I'm really sorry to bring you this super short video, but there's just nothing really to break down from this episode because it, it really sucked. All right. It was bad. Um, so yeah, I'd say that's about it guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you comment your thoughts on this video down below, as well as your thoughts on the episode. I'm interested to see what you guys have to say about this and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.